what up YouTube fans, uh, Evo Reg here, just making a very quick video response to uh, Warboss Tay's uh, Tau, Forgewell Tau uh, video clip. Um, here's one I've been working on, not quite finished yet, as with most projects I tend to start and keep going back to them over the course of uh, a few months. Uh, doing so uh, uh, this particular model features on my blog so if you want to see step-by-step -step instructions on how I've achieved this look so far then just check that out at evilreg-painting-log.blogspot.co.uk or you could just google Evil Ridge Painting Log um, and that generally comes up and uh, you can check out step-by-step -step, uh, guides to how I've achieved this look so far um, most of the most of my work went on the base. I'll just see if I can. I'll just see if we can get a bit of a closer look at this guy here. So he's not finished yet. Um, I've still got a bit more highlighting to do. I've got to finish off some of the some of the. Um, in fact, we'll take him off here. Take him off the base. If he'll come. There we are. Look. And we can see. It. We can have a look at this guy a bit more closely. So that's the colour scheme we've got. Um, like I say, most of the paint, step-by-step -step painting instructions are on the um, on my blog, but basically worked from a, a Kemri Brown foundation paint um, with the white bits base coated in a heavy warm grey. Uh, then I uh, uh, went over the top with like desert yellow and then a uh, bleach burn highlight which I haven't finished all over yet and you can see if you look at this this leg here if I can get it to do it in, well, in focus I've chosen to do like a blue highlight on the um, on the metal parts uh, I was going really uh, trying to go for like an alien feel to the metal. Like this, this battle suit's been made from. Uh, um, oh, that's rather embarrassing. I think I've just broke that. I have. What I will point out with these battle suits, or this particular one, um, there seems appears to be a bit of a weak point there. Um, hardly hadn't. Hold of that, so a bit of pinning in need there. It's rather embarrassing, isn't it? Never mind, like I said, this uh, ain't quite finished yet, this model. So, um, that's where we're to on there. Um, put a lot of effort into the base for this guy. Uh, if I just sit him down there before I break him anymore. Um, yeah. There we go, there's the base, and again, if you check the blog out, then it'll say on there almost all the story and the theme that I came up with to go behind, the, behind this, um, behind the base here, um, long story short, the um, the miniature here is jumping away after uh, putting a couple of rounds through the uh, lower torso of this space marine, this poor space wolf guy, so anyway, I'm going to leave it at that guys, uh, Merry Christmas, um, quick glimpse, that's what I'm currently working on at the moment for my NIDS videos, and I'll explain what you're going to do there and what I'm going to be doing there, I'm just going to do five termagants five and five gene stealers in a colour scheme that, I, that I've got in mind, uh, and it also looks like I'm going to uh, have to pin and glue this guy back together again now as well, uh, so uh, there's... Uh, Evil Reg feeling particularly silly now, signing out and wishing everyone a happy new year. Later's all.